high-speed aerial warfare, the rapid transmission of reliable and essential information to all the operational centers concerned is a vitally necessary service. When even seconds can stand between success and failure, there must be a means whereby information can be gained readily of movements of aircraft beyond the line of our coast. Science has provided us with this means in radar. Portsmouth, air aid warning, red. How is the service of radar put to use, and how much of its success is dependent upon compliance with flying regulations? Radar identified. Stand down. Stand by direction, angle two out. Angle two out. Next side, please, please. Help! The answer lies here, in what is known as the filter room. The purpose of the filter room is to produce a presse of the information provided by the radar chain and by a telling forward of this presse to aid in the successful interception and destruction of the enemy and the safe passage of friendly aircraft. The telling also aids in securing the safety of the civil population by providing the information from the radar chain upon which the working of the air raid warning system depends. This production of information needs some explanation. So, for a time, let us not only look at what is happening here in the filter room, but listen to what is being said. Yes, but that's no plot. We're only getting 20 plus on 165 now, sir. That'll be quarter past one. Take off curtain 143. Anything in Woolly Nair 1753. Make 164 a fighter. Next area, 1,005, please. North West W. Woolly 3564. We still got two men, eh? We still got two men, eh? Stand by, former 156 SOS1 at North W. William, 3681, 3681, friendly 137. Chain southeast, X for X-ray, 5732, 5732, former 160. Ted, stand by, former 160, 20 plus at 17. Yes, it's more than a little difficult to assimilate it all to select those things necessary for us to obtain an ordered picture and appreciate exactly what is taking place. The personnel are continually changing, even during a given watch, for the work demands a high degree of concentration and frequent rest periods are necessary. Thus, it is difficult to associate a particular face with a specific job. However, let us take it slowly and follow successive stages. Two main streams flow into this room. The first stream is information received from the radar stations which is plotted on the table by each plotter as he or she receives it from his or her particular station. This information is then filtered into track form by the filterers. In other words, the value of the information passed in by the individual radar stations is carefully assessed. The assessment acts as a sieve, the result of the sieving being shown in the form of a track, which gives only the basic and essential 
detail. It must be understood, however, that not always can separate tracks be laid for each individual aircraft flying within the scope of radar. There is a limit to the number of separate tracks that can be dealt with successfully and simultaneously upon the plotting table. Therefore, when the numbers of aircraft flying are such that the accurate tracking of all of them cannot be achieved, they are grouped into one or more areas and the collective information of such areas is filtered. The second stream is the advance notification of movements of friendly aircraft. The movements are collected and collated by the movements liaison section and are distributed to all who need to know about them, including the controller of the filter room. These two streams of information are coordinated by the controller who applies his knowledge of the intended movements of our own aircraft to the tracks produced upon the filter room table by the plotters and filterers and thus endeavors to identify them. The final track, filtered and identified, is then told forward simultaneously to all who are concerned to know what aircraft are flying within the sphere of their operational responsibility. It is told to American Defense Wing Headquarters, to Command Operations Rooms, to group, sector, and intruder operations rooms, and to Royal Observer Corps centers. Everyone, in fact, who must know of the movements of aircraft beyond our coast receives information which the filter room is able to supply. As it is told, it is recorded so that it is available for future analysis, both for intelligence and security purposes. Change party 154, do stand by. Party 154, now 1, 2 plus at 2, 5. Southwest Willie T. Patel, 0123, 0123, Hostile H161. Now let us take a part of an average day and watch carefully to see how the work of the filter room relates to that of the air crew. Take off that track. No. Fighter 159. That's it. There'll be another big show at 1600 hours. I'll give you more details when I've worked it all out and when all these fellows are back again. track orbiting in Willy Willy 1-8. There's one aircraft staying behind to look after the chap in the dinghy and they're getting out of relief section as soon as they can. a fighter. I've taken fighter 173 as the aircraft orbiting the Mayday. Thanks. That confirms the fix nicely. Beachy Head, North Victor, 3297, Bomber 165.
The rest seem to be going all right. And the hands turned for home. It's a new track here, sir. Next serial, three plus two zero. Last clock's on number one six five, Peachy. Okay? Ma'am? There's a new track southwest of Dungeness, sir. Three plus at 20,000 feet. That will be the Hastings Patrol. We'll have a fighter on that. Beachy Head, North Queen, 3004. Bomber 165, 100 plus aircraft, height 8, IF. Bomber 165, no overland, ma'am. May I take it off? And what about 164, ma'am? Wait a minute with that. You see, 164, I've taken him with a bomber, but I'm not quite happy. Have the observer corps picked him up yet? Hold on a sec. Have you got 164? Hello, Horsham. Have you got bomber 164 yet? Change. Do you know? 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 Do all right, remove 164. The Huns have gone down too, sir. Shall we head them off? Remove hostiles 170 and 171. Change hostile H170. Don't stand by. Hostile H170 removed. Change hostile H171. Don't stand by. Hostile H171 removed. Change northeast sea for Charlie. 1875. 1875. Serial 179er. Two stand by. Serial 179er. One at 18. Change north sea for Charlie. 1978. 1978. Serial 179er. Two stand by. Serial 179er. One at 18. Fly Charlie 0976, serial 179er. One aircraft, height. Charlie 0976, a serial 179er. A one aircraft, height. There's a new track in Baker Charlie, sir. That can't be the weather record. He's due back over Austin. It must be a hunt. Give me an H for hostile, please. But she was beautiful, broad of hip and broad of mind. Hmm. No hands of that. Glad I thought of taking a look at the app on the way back. Serial 179er, now hostile H 179er, one at one eight. Thank now. Serial 16, section red. Squadron 505, patrol Beachy Head, 20,000 feet. Correct? DM, those were the days, and that was the night. What was her name? Uh, Lucille, that's it, Lucille. Lucille. Mm. Good old DM. Here's the plan of campaign for the next show. One second, sir. Is that the weather record? Yatsil ist harich. 
Und Sie haben um 15.20 Uhr über Ostende zu sein. He's a bit late, but it must be. He's right on his course. He's hmm. taking me a bit off course. Then she always did. Great kid, Lucy. Ah, and there's good old Dieppe. Boy, what a town. And what a girl. Have a check on the speed of fighter 182. Check the speed on 182 carefully. Speed 300, ma'am. Speed 300, sir. All right. I've taken 182 over Ostend as your weather record. His speed's right, and he's dead on course for Harwich. What a hun to be seen. Well, now to beat it like hell for home. Speed of 300 on hostile 179 as well, ma'am. That will be the section of 505. There the fellows put up against the hunt. Intercept 179, Sergeant, with red section. No okay, case, sir. Uh, hello, Magpie. Hello, Magpie. This is Rick Bat. One bandit south of you. Vector 160, Angel 15. Over. All at once, he was my king. It's almost like a peacetime flip. Northwest W for William, 4762. 4762, hostile H179. Change south of Roger, 2805. 2805, fighter 184. Jet standby, fighter 184, one pass at 20. Hello, Brickbat. Hello, Brickbat. Bandit is Spitfire. What the devil do they think they're up to? Hostile 179 is a spit. It must be the wrecker. Make Hostile 179 a fighter. My God. 179 is the record. What on earth is that? Change 182 to X. 
Bombs on heritage. 8X182, hostile. Well, it's been a most uneventful trip. It's a pity 179 couldn't see all the trouble he's caused. Now, we'd better go over to this big show. Ask the senior filter to come up. I'll go over and see if the MLO can take over for a bit. And then I'll explain the whole thing. Miss Lakin, will you come up a moment, please? That, then, is something of the working of the filter room. We have seen that the accurate plotting, sorting and reporting of aircraft movements can be difficult even when only a few aircraft are flying. How much more difficult this must be when hundreds of aircraft are operating. The sorting out of all the information involved, the warning of the approach of hostile forces, the assisting of aircraft in distress, in short, the keeping informed of all who need to know what is happening in a given area, even as it happens, is no easy task. Therefore, so that we may fully appreciate the factors involved if successful functioning of the filter room is to be aided by those who fly, let us return to study what happens during a big-scale operation. And again, let us watch closely. Beachy Head, south of Roger, 0200, track 2, 80 plus aircraft. Fairlight, southeast, Willy, 0397, track 1, 100 plus aircraft. The bombers are just going out, sir. They're just on time. About time we saw some Huns. Plot in Baker Charlie, four, five, six, eight, sir. How about that, sir? Hello. One reaction coming up now at Charlie 79, track coming to a bus. There's a new track south of Celsius, sir. Yes, that will be the 12 Mosses. That is a coastal. Coastal on 218. Is the strength on the Hun all right? Looks as though there might be a bit of a scrap. Check the numbers of aircraft again. And is the height on hostile 216? All right. I think it's high now, ma'am.
Change, hostile H216, to stand by. Hostile H216, 20 plus at 30. Hello, Skylark. Hello, Skylark. Brickbat calling. Bandits now 30,000. Over. Thank you. The escort wing is engaged. off the table. Give me an amp mix up, please. Sir, South of St. Cass, coming in. That's not one of the bodies coming back early. It must be a hurry. No, I have No IFF at the moment, sir. Well, for the moment, I'll exit. Hello, Ops. I've put an X on 229. There's no IFF, and I can't tell yet whether he's one of the mozzies coming back early or a hound. Change, serial 229er. Tote standby, serial 229er. Now raid X 229er. The mix-up seems to be turning now, sir. Yes, it should be just about now. Northeast Z for Zebra. Niner eight six four. Niner eight six four. Raid X two two niner. Tote standby. Raid X two two niner. One plus at two. There's still no IFF on that other track, I suppose. No, sir. It's just the kind of low track that might be a hun. Hmm, or some idiot who's forgotten his IFF. You got the IFF on, Joe? How? No. Ah, oh, that's better. A bit late, though. Change X229 to Coastal. Change rate X229, to come by. Rate X229, now coastal 229, one plus at two. This is 
if you're going to be busy. Okay, suits me. Try and get some of the busy bottles of relief. Will you come here a moment, please? Get some of the busy bottles relieved, please. Yes, ma'am. Put the height on the fighters up to 33. Reduce the numbers on the mix up to 16 to 100 plus. And make it 50 plus on the track going out. Change mix up 216 to the original bomber serial number. Can you remember it? No, sir. Bomber 207. And make the outgoing track hostile 216. Dry Willie, 2534, comma 207, 100 plus aircraft, height 20, showing broad IF. Ma'am, there's SOS on bomber 207. Ask the MLO to tell flying control there may be SOS on bomber 207. Bomber 207 SOS. To stand by. Bomber 207 SOS. 100 plus at 15. pretty far west, he may be in trouble. Watch him carefully and try and get a speed on him. Watch the height on 239 carefully. Yes, ma'am. Get a careful check on the speed of 239, please. Very good, ma'am. Ma'am, it's faded at 32. Right. The SOS is faded, ma'am, at 41. Right, thank you. Ma'am, SOS faded at 32. You are sure it's faded, aren't you? SOS on bomber 207, faded at 32. Yes, sir. I checked it up myself. Right. Ask the MLO to tell flying control SOS is faded on bomber 207. Looks as though somebody might have gone in the drink. Yes, sir. Give them the pinpoint. Willie, 2575. Yes, London, Mother, Nut. Ask the other stations to get a bearing, please. Oh, Pullen, Atkinson. Have you a bearing on SOS Kite, Uncle, London, Mother, Nut? One, nine, five, and a half, class one. One, six, six, class two. Here you go.
Air Headquarters, MLO, please. I have a fix on aircraft Uncle London Mother Nuts, which is ditching. 5220 North, 0019 East, first class, 1745. Got an MFD fix on that one just before he ditched. It ties up with our pinpoint. I've told Flying Control and also his station. Good. There's a bomber ditched in Willie 2575, sir. Right. You have him, please. Fighter 239 is losing height fairly rapidly. If it pays, get me a good pinpoint. Get me flying control. Flying control, sir. Hello. Fighter 239 has faded. Looks rather as they're going to the sea. Yes, that's what I think. They thought so too. They're taking rescue action. Lucky we were able to track him without an SOS through all this stuff. Do you think we might clear the table a bit now? Yes, sir. They're nearly all over the coast. And the Huns have gone home. Well, what's that not north of Kelly? Just gone down, sir. I see there's any more. Dover, Sugar, 1451. Track 1, 1 aircraft. Height one minus. Sugar one four five one. Track one, one aircraft. Height one minus. It's a new track, sir, and it's coming in. Get some more information on it as soon as you can. Looks like a hun to me. Hello, Ops. There's a hun coming in from Cali. Low one. There's a low flying hun coming in from Cali, sir. Okay. Big Hill. Operations calling, operations calling. Index red section scramble, index red section scramble out. One, two, one, three, one, four. Keep open mind. Hostile approaching from southeast in Sugar 15 at zero feet. Serial 243, tell Hastings, Ashford, Dover. Serial 243, Sugar 15. <laughs>
We ought to be seeing him now. program begins in 12 minutes time. The start of the night program means dusk. And dusk means the use of resin and navigation lights. The darkening sky demands increasing vigil from air crew. Makes no difference to the eyes of radar, however. The work of the filter room continues just the same. Hello, what on earth is that? Hello, Navigator. Seems to be taking us quite a while to get to Celsieville. We should be just about there now. It's obviously friendly. Could be one of those Whitley learners due to turn back at Selsey. I'll go on flying control. Get me flying control. Make it a friendly. Well, it seems a long way to me. I think you'd better get a fix. Okay, Skip. Hello, Wub. Get me a fix. Okay, navigator. Flying control, sir. Hello. I've taken 247 as friendly. He's probably a Whitley going much too far out to sea. He may be in trouble. Okay. I'll watch him and get ready to lay on a homing if necessary. Hello, Navigator. Have you got that fixed yet? Hello, Wub. Have you got that fixed yet? Yes, just came through! I say, Skip, we've all the shot. You better turn now. I'm turning already. A bit of finger trouble there, wasn't there? Polling North, Vic 3070, friendly 247. Vic 3070. Listen, fellas, I don't like the sound of this port engine. The rat temperature's rising now. I thought so. We've got a glycol leak. Have we? Yes. I'm going to feather the port air screw. Uh, when we cross the coast, I'm going to ask for homing. Okay, Skip. Hello, navigator. 
call the Wallace operator to switch IFF over to distress. Hello, Wireless Op. Turn the IFF switch on to distress. Okay, navigator. IFF distress switch on. Queen 3000, Broad IF. Queen 3000. Get me flying control. Hello, Ops. Let me know when the observer call pick up friendly 247. Have you picked up 247 yet? Flying control. Hold on, please. Hello. Flying control. We're telling SOS on 247. Hello, Horsham. Hello, uh, Queen. Two nine zero one three. 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 Two nine zero is asking for homing. Tangmere, Ops B, Bomber 247 is asking for homing. 01, 02, 04, homing beams on Thorny. Queen 1938. Okay. Projector steady. Down. Up. Whistle. The searchlights have got us. Yes, remove friendly 247. I didn't want him mixed up with those outgoing bombers. You've come just at the right time. Yes, it looks as if I've walked into a bit of a party. What sort of an afternoon have you had? Oh, the usual. Well, here you are. It's all down here. The bombers are beginning to come out. And it's the first thing they can down here, the next way. Right. All yours. By the way, good luck with the party.